Hello guys, and welcome back. So yeah, that was really tragic. That was total fail. Um, that always happens for some reason at this part of the game. Whenever I'm collecting the secret, the last secret of the level. Wait, I think that was the last secret. Let me check. Yep, it was. Yay, all six secrets. Alright, so I'm going to try and jump without getting impaled by the spikes. Let's see how this goes. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly what I wanted to do. Um, I'm not being sarcastic, it is. So that's jump number one. Now I just have to do a second jump and not miss it. Christ. Yes, that's it, Lara. Thank you very much. Whew, for a second there I thought I'd, when I jumped up vertically I was going to land in the spikes once again. So yeah, that's the last secret of the level. But as I said, I always seem to j just mess up that jump for some reason. But yes, let's continue past the three boulders. Three boulders in the first level, really? No, sorry, four bold. No, five boulders. Five boulders in the first level. Christ, that's mean. I mean, obviously, Tomb Raider is known for having many boulders, and the, that monkey is just walking through the water as if you know everything's normal. <laughs> that's quite funny, actually, because it was like submerged completely. Um. Yeah, so, that many boulders in one level I think is totally mean, but yes, here I am in the water, it's so nice, take a quick dive, where am I going, there's a giant log in the water, ah, what will be through here, I wonder, I don't know why I'm speaking like this, hmm, a room with fire, and a lever, <gasps> What does it do? I wonder. Oh my god, it opens a door. I love opening doors. Doors are fun. Another lever. What does it do? And it opens another door. Oh, I was gonna actually dive there, but never mind. Ah, oh, right, okay. So I wonder what's on top of this little island. Let's see. Some flares, yay. Well, that's pretty good because the PlayStation 1 version, the one I'm playing now, obviously, of Tomb Raider 3 is really dark, um, both stylistically and, you know, in terms of the, the atmosphere of the game, it's got really... Tomb Raider 3 has a really strange feeling to it, a really strange dark feeling. Um, you know, I suppose you could argue that, you know, previous Tomb Raiders uh, 1 and 2 were also pretty dark. This is dark too, but it has this strange quirkiness to it, it's, you know, it's a very mischievous feeling game. Well, I don't know how to describe it, um, what better adjective to use for this game, but yeah, there's just something about it, I can't quite place my finger on it. But yeah, even the, the steam tune that's on right now, it's very mischievous sounding. It's very mysterious. Very interesting. Yay! Another save crystal. It is mine. Do a little weird maneuver. Ah, look at the waterfall pouring over the hill. It's awesome. Yeah, it's just a really, really nice level. Really nice looking level. So yeah, I need to go up here through the lovely waterfall. But yeah, I mean, as I said before, this level is really nice looking. I mean, I would probably come on holiday here, it's that nice looking, you know, I get to run around in a nice tropical jungle, you know, walk through little waterfalls like this, get to climb up here and face some tigers, um, do really dangerous jumps, um, you know, avoid spike traps and dodge boulders, maybe I'll just stay home to be honest because this, you know, I don't think it's going to cost, I don't think it's going to be very cheap to insure myself if I went all the here, so fuck this. Yeah, I don't know what I'm saying, sorry. So in that case I'm just going to dive down here and not die hopefully, yes. I thought I was going to cripple myself on that pillar for a second there. Bubbles! 
Yeah, I'm actually almost at the end of the level, in fact. Already? I'm sure I've missed something. No, I've got... Oh, crap. Tiger. Ah, oh shit, I should use a medipack. I'll just use a small one. Because I'm hardcore like that. Oh, crap. Die. Ah, stop eating me. That's what you get for trying to eat me. And I can hear a monkey. And I believe these are... Layers, maybe? I think they're shotgun shells, in fact. It's very dark. I can barely tell what I'm picking up. And Tomb Raider 2, um, you had the item appear at the side of the screen after you picked up, so you would get like a larger view of what the, act the actual item was, but in this one, no such thing happens. Okay, made a strange wading sound, even though I'm not even wading through the water, but never mind. What's up here? I can hear a monkey. There's a key, and that monkey's gonna try and steal it. Come and get it, bitch. Haha, it's mine. I hope I took it. You mad? Heh, <laughs> it's my key, not your key. What are you gonna do? You can't do anything, because you're just a stupid little monkey. I've got the key, so haha. -ha. And there's a tiger down here. And they must eat me up. Ah. Stop it. Die, thank you very much. I don't think there's anything up here that I can get. Nope. Okay, without further ado, let's um let's finish the level. All I have to do is use the Endara key. I was about to say Enfada key. It's not the Enfada key. And this is actually the end of the level. Way through some quicksand and we're done. Hello? Hello? What? What do you want from me now? Nothing that taxing. Are you alright? Well, if you'd all stop, I might be just fine. Just a hundred percent. Just go! If you'd all stop, who are you talking about? All you, hundreds of you, talking and chattering and breaking my brain up. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm not quite sure where you're coming from. But I just want to know about the Infada artifact. In the temple up there. <laughs> voodoo magic and all, huh? I don't touch this stuff myself. It's not voodoo. Look, is there anyone else here with you? Yeah, Randy and Rory. <laughs> Randy and Rory? Where? What are you all doing here? Well, they're staying put in that temple. I told them not to. I warned them first. Not doing much now, I doubt, under half a ton of mudslide. Me. I'm leaving. Next bus out. This jungle has rooted enough rot into me. I'd offer the same advice to you, but you don't seem like the type to take it. To care if I said you're gonna die, man. <laughs> yeah. Die.